Thank you for stopping by the Northern Ants channel. Today we're going to kind of tell a little bit about my backstory on how I got into ant keeping and beekeeping. The first book here was one that I checked out a lot from my library at my school. As you can see, it was from fourth grade till eighth grade. I checked it out quite a few times a year because that was our internet. We didn't have internet in the, back in the 80s. It was, uh, I started at five years old, so 1980, I kind of started with sitting and watching ants. And uh, this was a picture of me at uh, nine years old. And then I think I was like 12 or 13 or a little older there. I was watching some wasps and that. And this is how I would keep my ants. I would have them in either a fish tank. I had a really nice wood ant uh, queen, plus a really nice sized polyergus colony which had a lot of males and females and lots of eggs. And, and I had that in a 35 gallon. That I have videos about on my channel if you want to check them out. This is my first honeybee queen. These are the first two hives I got back in 1994. And one was my brother's and I bought him out eventually. These were 10 packages of three pound packages of bees. They're only 25 bucks a piece back then. <laughs> And then this is a couple of my different bee yards that I had set up back in 98. I was running 60 hives, uh, selling honey at seven different stores and doing farmer's markets and flea markets and things like that to sell honey. It was a lot of fun. It was a lot of work though also, but enjoyed it while I did it. And I did ants at the same time. Uh, didn't get too many videos because it didn't have cameras that did really well at close up. That was an extractor that I used for extracting my honey. It was a 20 frame. And then I got my Tar Heel Ants uh, set up. I uh, got those about six months ago. It was August. I found Tar Heel Ants online. And now that I'm able to keep my ants alive, I am able to provide uh, some good content. I'm hoping everybody enjoys. And working on improving all the time. And come the summer, it'll be really nice to be able to get out and do some videos of getting out there collecting ants and things like that and I'd love to be growing uh, with everybody so if you haven't subscribed yet please do so right now uh, get that bell icon hit and uh, that way you can know when new videos are coming out and we're gonna be showing we're showing some uh, harvester ant uh, footage right now uh, really cool we've got a lot of like the harvester ant larvae and them eating and things like that so I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will talk to you in the comments. Thank you.